Hey, what's going on everybody? This is Tyrone back with Tech Life, and this will be a shorter video. I just wanted to confirm something with you guys and keep you up to date. So what we have here is a screenshot of the service mode on the Samsung Galaxy S8 T-Mobile variant. Now for some of you guys that don't know what the service mode is, it's a code that can be entered on your dial pad that will take you to the setting and you can see what LTE bands you connect to, what configurations you have on the carrier aggregation, and it will also show you what LTE bands are available on the device. So <clears throat> this confirms that the device does not have support for 600 megahertz, so no band 71, but it does have support for two new bands. The first one is band 66, and the other one is band 252, and 255 they're both the same they support LTEU which is that unlicensed spectrum that I reported early on for T-Mobile so this phone supports it so once T-Mobile rolls it out this is a very very future proof phone now it does not have the capability of doing the low band 600 but it can do the 66 band 66 and it can also do the LTE unlicensed so this is definitely an important step forward for T-Mobile in the race to 5G and gigabit speeds and all that stuff. Samsung Galaxy S8 is, is a very good device to have on T-Mobile if you're planning on upgrading or switching to T-Mobile. I would definitely look at this Galaxy S8 as far as network performance goes. So also if you need that code for the Samsung Galaxies on T-Mobile or AT&T, I will leave the link to the video in the description down below. I made a video and then you can see how to get in it and also you will see the code as well on that video so definitely stay tuned to the channel give these videos a thumbs up it keeps me motivated it keeps me going like share subscribe and I will see you guys in the next video peace